Hello guys, this is Ankur here and I welcome you to my YouTube channel, Technical Analysis, The Invest View. So today we're going to have a quick review on Bank Nifty's day's chart. So this is Bank Nifty's day's chart. So uh, let's go behind and let's see that this is the area which was a pre-COVID high as, as it is mentioned over here. And this, this area was the resistance for the time being unless this was not... Uh, broke out right so this is the pre-covid bank nifty is high after that uh, on 2020 march bank nifty made a low and then it took a support over here and then the bank nifty again took a support over here therefore this particular support trend line was formed right till november of 2020 this trend line was formed on the basis of these three acts of the bank nifty which it took the support after that we have seen that in january 2021 bank nifty again reached at the same area which was the pre-covid high right as you can see it is reached at the same area it felt the resistance at the first instance and then it retraced and after the retracement again it broke with a very long bullish green candle Correct. So you can see that pre-COVID resistance slash breakout. So it took the resistance at the first instance, then uh, it retraced a little bit and then it broke it fantastically. Then uh, once at that point in time when Nifty broke this pre-COVID resistance uh, area, this was the high. After that, again, it attracted towards the same area which converted into a support as well as the resistance. It had a small breakdown or you can say a false breakdown and again it retraced and again it took the pullback and breakout from this area in May 2021. Correct? May 2021. So ever since this area was broke, the first it came to test in January 2021 and then May 2021. Then after that, we saw the second high, uh, the top, the made by Bank Nifty was this area. Understood? After that, again, Nifty took uh, some correction and again it reached and it formed uh, this particular uh, second lower high. Then subsequently the third lower high. So on the basis of these three tops, which is like a lower highs, this trend line was formed. And on the basis of these three support uh, areas, this particular trend line was formed. Now, if you connect both the areas, you will get this kind of a triangle pattern. This kind of a triangle pattern. Now, with respect to the support trend line, we have one citation, two, three, four. Correct. So far, the Nif bank Nifty was respecting this support trend line. And it was taking the support and uh, bouncing again and again, right? For the first time, you can see recently uh, with respect to the Friday's closing, Bank Nifty closed below this area. So it broke the trend line, correct? It broke the trend line. Latest, if you see in this particular year, Bank Nifty tested the same trend line on March 2022 in that particular month and again it bounced back very beautifully. Correct? Now you can see that there is a particular dotted line which is also acting as a trend direction for the Bank Nifty which we call it as a regression line. On the basis of the regression line, you see whenever the Bank Nifty is sustained above the pre-COVID high area, which is over this band. The bank nifty took the resistance over here. So the, this is the first uh, formation of the regression band. Bank nifty did some consolidation over here and then it pulled back. Again, it came back. Again, it took the support in the regression line above this area. Correct. Again, it came back. It got attracted and tested the same pre-COVID area highs this particular area and again it broke the regression line again it pulled back now this area for us on monday or tuesday or wednesday the coming week this is a confluence point between the pre-covid high area which is a support come resistance the regression correct as well as 
it is below the trend line support trend line or the lower base of the triangle pattern so what eventually we have to see whether the bank nifty takes the support of because this is a very strong support this is a very strong support because you're going to have a support of the pre-covid high area correct which as you can see that it came down and then it took the support and it made a very steep high and again you can see that in march 2022 it tested over here so the, at this point in time it was a confluence between this particular trend line and the pre-covid area the support come resistance so it took a strong support and bounced back from here now this is the again time where the nifty is having a confluence point between this regression line and the pre-covid area high so if it if at all bank nifty comes over here even if it is break down and bounce back and closes above this area we can expect a strong pullback right or if the bank nifty doesn't test this area and if the bank nifty resumes this trend line and start moving above this particular trend line then again you can expect a strong pullback area and we can keep this trend line as a stop loss or if at all bank nifty breaks this area correct so keep this area only as a stop loss and do the short or bank nifty will become weak or you can develop a sell trade so the point behind today making today's video is that wherever we find a very interesting areas in the index or stock which can decide the trend correct so far you see this area decided the trend it went up this area decided the trend it went up this area decided the trend it went up uh, again we are at the same area where the bank nifty is going to attract to this particular band with a confluence area of the regression so if and confluence area of regression means you see this area it took the support this area it took the support this area it took the support right so it's a confluence area it's a confluence junction between the regression and the pre-covid high band right so if it takes the support and again try to bounce back it could be a very sharp bounce back at the thousand thousand five hundred even two thousand points even up to three thousand points right so keep an eye on this area uh trade as per the level straight as per the area if bank nifty is closing below the pre-covid high uh, i don't think so we should uh, uh anticipate a bounce immediately let it close above this area show some strength and let it cross the high uh of a previous day and then we can develop a long trade having a same stop loss so this is the stop loss for a longs and short both correct so this is the area where for the fourth time i can say the bank nifty has come and let's see whether it this time it respect the same uh, pre-covid area a uh, highest band which is support come resistance area or whether it breaks down further it's a very very important area which will decide a trend for a particular month or maybe i can say for next couple of months right so if it again bounces back and take the support then it could be a some a good pullback of thousand to two thousand to three thousand maybe four thousand points in bank nifty and if at all if it breaks this time correct so keep this as a resistance this will definitely develop as a resistance and let's see how far it will go down and take the support so let's wait for the development and i'll keep this chart safe and next time we'll see what kind of development is happening in bank nifty whether it is taking the support or it is breaking down this important area and then subsequently we can decide in the next video then how to go about it but keep an eye draw the same chart in your respective systems in your uh, software wherever whatever uh, tools you use and see to that that bank nifty support takes the support or it breaks out uh, sorry i mean breaks down if it taking the support and it if it uh, takes a pull back and it resumes this particular trend line it just started moving above this trend line then you can expect it will take a resistance over here somewhere correct so this could be a good range play on a long side for the bank nifty so this was a quick analysis on uh, bank nifty keep this chart uh draw the same trend lines i've tweeted this as well so draw it keep it safe and this will help you to generate at least two to three thousand points either sides in bank nifty in coming days and coming weeks so thank you guys. This was a quick analysis on Bang Nifty. Hope you enjoyed it. Thank you. Bye bye.